Sports Cruiser came to us quite a long time ago um, with the scope of what they wanted in this system. So uh, a system that's very reliable, has a great level of redundancy uh, and is also very light in its applications. Instead of having a holistic system all in one unit where you've got, you know, one unit that's doing three separate things which is solar, DC, DC and AC, we've got all that broken down into multiple different units. And those individual units, if you have a single failure, there's another unit that can take over and do that same job. It's a holistic approach to an electrical system in a caravan. So if you have a fault or anything needs to be repaired or something's not quite working the way that it needs to, it's one phone call to one company, not multiple phone calls to different electrical suppliers or to the manufacturer and trying to figure out you know, what's going on or where the issue is actually coming from. Okay, so in this particular compartment here, um, we've got our AC charger, our DC charger, main distribution block, um, all of our circuit breakers for the whole system, um, and then underneath this we've got our inverter and obviously our lithium battery over this other side here. So what we've got here is a 60 amp AC charger. So this is, as the name explains, it's a 60 amp charger. Uh, it's got a heck of a lot of punch to put into your batteries. Um, whether it be AGM or lithium or even lead acids, um, in this case we are dealing with a lithium battery. Um, it's even more beneficial because that battery is capable of absorbing all of that charge and it will charge at about twice the rate of an AGM. So the next one across from there is our DC to DC charger. Um, so this one here is controlling your vehicle charge and then also your solar as well. Um, the really big benefits with this guy is obviously that that's a 40 plus unit, so it's capable of up to 50 amps of charge from the vehicle, provided your vehicle's providing with enough power. Uh, and then obviously it's an 800 watt solar controller as well. So an inverter, put simply, is basically an, uh, a unit that allows you to take 12 volt power and generate 240 volt mains power. So it allows you to run any appliances that you'd normally use at home. So kettles, toasters, uh, hair dryers, hair straighteners, um, coffee pot machine, anything like that you can run off, off this inverter from this battery pack. So the last part of our, um, of our sports cruiser system here is our 200 amp hour lithium battery. Um, this particular battery is a 200 amp hour. Um, we also have 125s and 100s. In most caravan situations, the 200 is by far the best choice. It gives you the most variety of use and it also gives you the largest capacity storage wise. So visually with this particular battery here, we've got a, a 200 amp hour lithium. So this battery is equivalent to 300 amp hour AGM batteries. Um, when you think about the weight saving, you're looking at 30 kilos per battery compared to only 25 kilos in this 200 amp hour lithium. So you're saving a significant amount of weight, you're increasing your storage, and you're also increasing your charge time as well. So you're going to be charging at a much faster rate. So the, the rest of this system is just the, the fusing and distribution for the system. So we've got independent circuit breakers for each of our systems coming in. What we've been using here is actually resettable circuit breakers. So what they are is when they reach a certain level, they will pop to not allow excess charge or for the system to overrun itself. The big advantage of using a resettable circuit breaker is that when you need it, you just re-engage it. So for example, if one of these popped and you're out in the bush, you don't have to go and try to find somewhere that has a fuse for you. You can just reset the breaker and keep going. So one of the criteria that uh, Sports Cruiser gave us when designing the system was uh, they wanted to have the weight evenly distributed and also in a very compact space. So by evenly distributed we're talking across the axle of the caravan. And obviously given that we don't have a huge amount of space to work with here, we've been able to fit the battery plus the inverter, our AC and DC charger and all of our fusing and componentry in, in this space working with them closely. So another uh, part of this, this design process with Sports Cruiser was to have this board laying flat so that it was much easier to read the displays, especially for customers who have glasses. Obviously fault finding throughout the system is a lot easier. The other really big benefit of this is that they're able to put the inverter underneath this board and obviously the battery across on the other side here and bringing that weight down nice and low across the top of the axles again. Mm -hmm.